guys, Angel here. Welcome to Whip of This. Today we are gonna be doing a fragrance showdown. And once again, I have Destiny with me today. Closest to me on my left and your guys far right, I have Azara Wanted. This is the original one. This is an eau de toilette. Then we have Coach Platinum, which is an eau de perfume. Uh, this one is definitely more for the mature crowd. Then you also have uh, 1 million, the original, and this is the 6.8 ounce version as you see here. And then we also have Bourbon by Bath and Body Works. This one you don't see uh, too many people review, but I decided just to see what she thinks of it. She's never smelled it before. This is also an eau de toilette. And you also have Carolina Herrera. This is an eau de toilette as well. I've done a review on it in the past. I might do another one in the future. Just let me know if you want one. On my far right and you guys far left, we're going to be checking out uh, the Spice Bomb, the original Spice Bomb, which is also an eau de toilette. And 1 million is also eau de toilette as well. So the only one is, that's eau de parfum is going to be uh, Coach Platinum. And uh, we're going to be smelling all these. I'll tell you guys the pricing and whatnot about them uh, while she smells them. We also have coffee and a shot glass right here. So let's get started. All right, so first things first, we're going to do this one. Uh, Azara Wanted. This is the original one. The notes in this one are really good. Uh, it's very fruity. Uh, we're also going to spray it over here so it doesn't really get in our face or anything. But pricing for this, uh, it's going to be about maybe 35 to probably $75. So yeah. Pretty. Yeah. It also has notes of like ginger and lemon in this one, so yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, so next up we have Coach Platinum. One cool thing about this, if you're traveling, you can just turn it the other way and uh, it'll lock in place. So that's a nice little feature. Uh, this one is going to run, like I said, this is Eau de Parfum, but it doesn't run high. It's about probably $50 to $75, so it's not too expensive. Yeah, this is meant for like more like the fall, but you can get away with it during the summer as well. I mean, you can wear any of these at any time that you feel like. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Would you rate uh, between those just so far like one to five, five being high? Um, I'll rate this one a four, mm -hmm. and I'll give this one a three. Okay, cool. All right, so we'll do one million. This is the original by Paco Rabanne. It was released in two thousand and twelve. We just did a video a while back. Uh, if you want to check it out, you can. Yeah, no, mm -hmm. this one's really good. Yeah. Pricing for this one, by the way, it's going to run about probably $65 to $75, depending on where you get it from. You can also do a gift set. You don't have to get this giant size. I would never get this size again. It's just overkill. But Bourbon by Bath & Body Works, you don't see a lot of people talk about this one. I wanted to see what she thought of this. Um, it's more of a fresh type of fragrance, so yeah. But be careful of the dye in this one as a, it's a little, if, don't wear white, just don't wear white. <laughs> this is interesting. Mm -hmm. I like it though. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very manly. Yeah. What would you rate it? One to five, five being the highest. Mm, I'll give it a 3.5. Okay. Yeah. It's not bad. It's a solid fragrance. Like it's really fresh guys. It's one of those like fragrances that you could wear when you get out the shower. As far as pricing, uh, it's really not that expensive. It's like $35, $45. I uh, will leave it in the link description below. Now, I don't know if they're going to discontinue this yet, so I would recommend you maybe check it out uh, before they do because Bath & Body Works is kind of known for doing that. Next up, we have Carolina Herrera. Uh, this is the CH1 for men. And uh, they also have the Preve. I want to check that out in the future. But for right now, let's go ahead and see how this smells. It's familiar. Mm -hmm. it smells good though. The notes in that are really nice. Uh, the top notes in it, it's like more of like a fruity type of top note, but it's solid. It's really good. I definitely recommend you check that one out. And then last but not least, we have Spice Bomb. I just added this original one to the collection probably a few months ago. Uh, I got this earlier this year in 2020 and uh, we'll see how it smells. She smelled all these before except the bourbon, like I was saying earlier. And uh, pricing for this, oh yeah. Pricing for this is going to be 65 to 75 dollars. You can also do a gift set and they do have other variations of it like Spice Bomb Extreme. Uh, they have Spice Bomb like by night if I'm correct too. All right, 
So, what did you think of that one too, by the way? It was good. Yeah, okay. I like that one a lot. All right, so now this is the long part, and she gets to decide. She gets to choose between all these fragrances, and she declares the winner of this. So, bear with us. We might time lapse. <laughs> Yes, I, okay. I know some of them. Yeah, I'm right, gonna put okay. this one first. What? Yes, I'm wow. putting that one first. That's I crazy. really like that one. All right, so Spice Bomb is in the first ranking. And then I will do one million. All right, <laughs> okay. For second. The original one million. Yes. thing about this too guys is that when they dry down it starts to open up and like the fragrance really start you start to see the real uh, essence in the fragrance and whatnot so yeah yeah I'm gonna do that one All third right. yes number three is a Zara Wanted the original one they also have By Night that one's good too but this is definitely more you can wear this more out more soon and then I'll do the coach All after right. So we got Spice Bomb, 1 million, Azara wants it in coach right now. You got two left. And then I'll do this one, and okay. this one is last. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So hopefully you guys can see it like this. Uh, that way, we'll try to do it all. That way you can see them better. But we have Spice Bomb in the front in first place. Uh, this is the original Spice Bomb. Uh, like I said, the extreme version of that one, it's more vanilla. It's a little bit softer. I'm not really too much of a fan of it and it also costs more too now one million original like i said this is a great fragrance you can use this it's really mature like i'd say if you're in your 20s you can definitely get away with this um it's great for date nights and whatnot and azara wanted is also a good one you can wear during the summertime or even the fall as well it really doesn't matter what you want to do with them it's just what they prefer uh what the people really say then you also have Coach Platinum, the Eau de Parfum is in fourth place. At number five, we have Bourbon by Bath & Body Works. And uh, this is a great, just fresh fragrance. Um, I definitely recommend you guys check it out. But like I said before, I, I recommend you like you buy it because you never know uh, when this will get discontinued from Bath & Body Works website. But like I said, it's a really good fragrance. I forget about it a lot, but it's really fresh. So I definitely recommend you check it out. And last place in number six speed, we have uh, Carolina Herrera. This is a CH1 for men, and uh, this one is good. I just, I want to check out the free one because a lot of people say they like that one more. Um, the way I would rank this, I would definitely say, I would probably put one million maybe at the number one spot and then Spice Bomb. And after that, I would put Azara Wanted, uh, Coach, and probably CH1 for men and then Bourbon. Uh, that's what I would choose. Let me know what you guys would do in the comment section below. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I want to give you guys some content for the quarantine because I know uh, there's not much really to do right now, but luckily in Virginia, they're kind of lowering down like the rules as far as social distancing. It's only us in here right now. Like we're not in the studio or anything, but that's it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Remember to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Please give this video a thumbs up. And they post another case to stay up to date with everything that's happening on the channel. Till next time, you guys. Peace out. So I'll say goodbye. Let's put the sun back in the sky. Tired of crying. Don't call me back. And then you have bourbon by Bath and Body Works in. Fifth Wait place. a second. What? Wait a second. Two, four, six. What? I did six colognes? Oh my gosh. I thought I did five balloons. I'm tripping. Crazy. <laughs> In fifth place, we have. <laughs>